How's it going everyone welcome back to darkness falls as you can see it's day 29 and i do have the time and that's because i crafted a watch and i put it on my military gloves that i bought now i bought a bunch of military gear while i was kind of traversing the map doing all the opening trade routes i also crafted a coil carbine and a coil shotgun these i will not be using just yet i'm gonna hold on to these for horde night we need a lot of lead I'm also crafting some ammo for these and I got a bunch of skill points. I cooked some food, apple pie. We got some red tea, vitamins. I bought it from every single scout that I could, you know, talk to. And we got our wellness up quite a bit. Now, I'm not going to waste a lot of time. We have a quest that we need to do over here. But first, I'll show you guys that we do have a Trader Hugh here, who's a lot closer than Trader Joel. And we're on tier threes with, I believe, uh, Hugh as well. So we'll probably start doing his quest since he's much, much closer to base. And he's probably gonna send us here anyways. Now, we also have a Trader Hugh down here. We have a Trader Jen here. And we have, I believe, uh, we got a Hugh over here. And then obviously, We've been to this gen. I could have sworn there was a wreck somewhere, but he doesn't really matter. Anyways, day 29. Spent a couple days because I did a lot of work. I got another one of these crafted. I crafted a bunch of concrete, a bunch of steel, um, and just so much work. I fixed up this place a little bit so there's no more holes. And so let's head over and I'll show you guys what I did with the base really quickly. I figured out why the pathing wasn't working. These bars right here, they, for whatever reason, did not see them as like a path to walk on. And I figured that out because when I built this, I had those bars here. And what they were doing is they were coming up here and then just punching these stairs. They were not coming up any further. They were just mad, I guess, that they didn't see a path to me or whatever. So we have this path now. It's a little wider than I wanted to, but for symmetrical purposes, I decided... I guess I could have put two like half blocks. I don't know. I don't like that it's so wide because that means they can all come and kind of just pile up here. But down here we got five blade traps and a little bit of a pit. I kind of reinforced this a little bit. It's still kind of sketchy because if all this dirt blows up, uh, this might come down. But then this is also small and it has a couple extra pillars. So that might keep it up. We got electric fence posts. That's fighting position number two. There's a couple battery banks in there and we have a few SMG auto turrets. We got a couple here for the main fighting position. We got one back there that's pointed in this direction, essentially for anybody that's coming here. And then the one in this corner right over there. That's for the birds. So hopefully that'll help. And this one will be, I didn't have time. I'm like, you know what? We'll see how this does. And then we'll worry about uh, fighting position number three. I should be able to go this way. Jump. Oh, made it. So I have some stairs, or uh, not stairs, but a ladder coming up. And there's a door there for me to go into. Right here. There's the battery banks. One of these has a switch hooked up to it. So I'd have to come here, turn the one on, and then come over here and turn the switch on for whatever reason is floating in the air. What the hell? All right, well, I'm going to have to fix that before the next horde. But this will be our, like, main little fighting position. I know it's not amazing because it's small. But also because it's small, uh, I have to be careful. I can't be throwing uh, <laughs> the pulse grenades in here because I'll die. I could throw in a Molotov, but i got to basically stand in this corner or open this door and be here. But if I open it, or actually not open the door. I can come back to the door maybe and toss it. And then that way the birds can't come in here that way. I might put a door here because sometimes, ooh, 
you know, I, I don't make that little gap and I fall down, which it will be very bad if that happens. So I might just put a door like this down just to kind of keep us safe and then I'll just open it once I'm in there. That way no one's tempted to come that way, which they really shouldn't because they don't really have a path other than coming here, beating on this and then coming around and hmm. I'm debating on whether or not up upgrading this to steel. We'll see how much steel I can craft in the next couple days. If I can craft a few, I mean, this is what, like eight pieces maybe? Or no, 12. So about 120 steel roughly to probably upgrade this. No uh, SMGs here. Uh, we'll do that eventually. Not right now though. Uh, let's, oh shit. Okay, okay. Good thing I put that extra point into parkour. But yeah, that's it. I mean, I shorten it like one block, so it's it's not as high. Um, it comes, I don't know. I don't know exactly what, what the math was on that, but I also have a relay that's hiding in there. I needed that for one of the uh, blade traps. I, I don't, man, we'll see how this does. This is a pretty, I mean, it's a pretty solid, I guess, base, but Darkness Falls does not play, so. Let's head over, let's do this uh, fetch real quick and let's get moving. I know I'm on tier fours, at least for the scout, which is a bit scary. Makes me wonder if I should have grabbed the coil carbine. But yeah, as I was saying, I'm on tier fours with the scout, but we're still tier threes, I think. Whoa, with the traders. Hopefully that'll change after today. And then the Horde Knight is in a couple days. So we've got two and a half days really of questing to do, which should hopefully get us some good stuff by then. What is this? Try med group. All right. Let me just make sure I got bullets in all of these things. Got some riffraff out there. Let's start off with the sledge and then we'll go from there. Hello. No one? Anyone in here? Hmm. Oh, what is going on with my video right now? Mm, not liking it. Ah! Shit! Oh, that's not good. My frames seem a little weird right now. I thought that was the Arlene that I hit. No. Oh. Yeah, I'm not liking this right now. Hmm. Shit, I can't even exit because I'm running a quest right now. Okay, come, 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 come. I missed. I missed again. Oh, got you that time. Here, here, let me get the doors. Bye bye. Whoa. Oh shit! I hear footsteps. Come on out, lady. Come on out. Come on, I open the door for you. How rude. Oh, I do not like my frames right now. Why must there always be an issue? Hello. Are they further up? Oh, that sucks. Whoa. Oh, I hear a bird. Where'd you go, bird? Oh, what the hell? Get up, nemesis! Uh, you dropped something. Uh, let's switch to shotguns real quick. Oh, I don't have anything to throw. Come here, bird. Oh, crap. What the hell? What was that? Okay, well, supplies are up here. I'm assuming so is the main loot, as well as... Probably all the zombies that are going to be in there. No? Oh, shit! Nope, I can't make that jump. Oh, this is bad. Oh. 
Extra crispies. Y'all dead? Nope. What is going on right now? All right, well, supplies are right here with the main loot. All right, we got to open this real quickly and then get the hell out of here. What do we got? Shotgun notes. I'll take that scrap and then I'll grab the rest. I am going to restart though, just to see if it helps with the frames. And then we'll just kind of pick things up right after that. This shouldn't hurt, right? Ooh, no. Okay, some cashish. All right, let me get on the bike. I'm gonna head over to Joel, turn this in, and then I'll like relog. Oh, I'm not liking this. Actually, I'm just gonna relog now. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. you must be mm -hmm. Let's see. Thank you. And here you go. Let's go Desert Vulture and Iron Spear or Reflex Sight Mod. Let's get the Sight Mod. So I can sell them to you. Okay, let me just sell these to our buddy here. I'll get rid of this as well. I don't think I need a bandolier mod. It says chest or leg armor. I'm pretty sure I have those already set up. And yeah, I think that's it. Let me just Let's double watch, check on the friend. bandolier. Oh, never mind. Yes. Good thing I didn't sell it. Okay, now I'm not gonna grab a quest from him, even though what is he giving me right now? He no, Maybe not inventory. Next time, happy travels, Tier survivor. threes. Okay. Let me just check her for vitamins. I'm not gonna grab jobs from her. I'm pretty sure she's gonna How give me tier fours you? as well. Yes. Oh my goodness. All right. Uh I don't know what tier fours are gonna give me with her. Now the reason I didn't grab one is because I don't want to be this far away. I'd rather be closer to home. So, oh man, the frames are still being a little weird. I don't know what that's about, but hopefully it clears up. Like I was saying, I'm going to head over to Joel's and grab a quest from him. Not Joel, sorry, Hugh. I'm going to grab a quest from Hugh and then start kind of just grinding quests with him because he is closer to home. And just to kind of make sure... Yeah, there we go. Because I kept seeing in the compass the little trader thing, but I'm pretty sure that's Anna, so I needed to put a marker down. Man, I love being able to tell the time. Oh, there's no guessing involved anymore. Whoops. All right, we're here. You know what? I kept getting some weird error when I was coming through this area, but I drove down that way last time. Just deal with these guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to completely log and then just kind of restart the game completely and see what if that fixes anything. So I will be right back. Okay, we're back and we logged and the weather is much nicer. I'll take it. Uh, just hope we don't have any more issues. Do not like issues. I guess I hadn't searched this place. Um, we got some people outside that are being a problem right now. How am I missing? Stay down. Anyone else? What? He ain't dead. Okay, now he is. He's got a bunch of ammo and bullets, so I could buy these bullet tips off of him. Not that bad. See, how much is all this lead? I could probably go mine up a bunch of lead. 180 lead for 500. No, thank well, you very much. Shut your face. You oh, or, wrong one. Or something else? Okay, let's grab... I wish it was tier fours, man. Let's do an infested for some ammo. No, I don't need ammo. And it's not going to give me coil ammo, so I'll pass on that. I don't, trust you, I don't think I've been to Scarecrow me. Field, so let's just try it out. And while we're at it, oh, where is our friend? Oh, that's right. She's right out here. I want, okay. I already got her vitamins. Goodbye. I want some. So if you look, I could do light armor crafting tier three. That's 9,000 Dukes. I, so far, it seems like the furthest she'll let me do is tier like level three. I could be wrong. I thought level two was the most before, but I don't know. Let's just grab a job off of her. Mm. Let's see, man-eater or nurses. Let's just me? do some nurses. 
Those shouldn't be too far away. They're like right here. So that's good. Listen, mama. Shut up. Ooh, beer. Yeah. That'll help. I need to repair this guy. How many repair kits do I have? A lot. Okay. And one more. There we go. Good as new. Let's go to the scarecrow quest. Hey, nurse. See you later. Excuse me, Tubbs. Oh, now I got to get this thing washed. I've been here. What? And then eventually we go in there, I think. Ah. All right. Well, I'm just going to use the hammer for now. Come on out. How did you do that? You were about to fall down and then you were standing. He's a magician. Yeah, there's someone in here. Oh, some ones. Nemesis. You bastard. Man, they still hit hard. Okay, from what I recall. Yep. Come on down. Come on, Doc. I got something for you. Uh, I want to scrap all this shit. What is this crap, huh? I'll take the nanites, though. Dude, I hear Tubbs is not a happy camper out there right now. Oh, what is going on with my frames? It's a wandering horde or something. What are you guys doing? Is this erect? <laughs> erect. <laughs> Where are you going, Steven? So sorry. And I know there's a big mama usually here. Ah, I see you. I see you. You're dead. Oops, I missed. Okay, come on down. We got... Ooh, there's my supplies. Oh, quest is done. Now we just kill some shit and get the loot. Come on! Dumbass. Ooh, Mr. Military. How come you're not waking up? Okay, okay. I'll just wait for you guys here. Oh, now you're awake. Get up, you jerk. Whoa! Whoa! Easy, Arlene. Such a wild one. And now we go down. I believe last time there was a couple big mamas on this side. This time it's uh, Nemesis and Mr. Biker Man. Oh. Oh. Twitching. Ah, I don't like that. Okay, I think it's going to get real froggy up in here in a second. God, I wish I had some throwables. Hello? Easy. I'm hearing more footsteps. Don't know who it is. Dynamite! Yeah, that's not gonna help. Lady! You're late to the party. I'm gonna take some vitamins. I think there is... Let's see, I got this. That lets me come out here. But there's no reason to do that. I gotta go around this way. There's gonna be some friends down here to say hello to. Hello, friends! Oh! Easy. I know there's like one more. No? Okay. Last time there was two. Okay, more friends in here. Yes, let's do this, huh? Stay down. Hey, big boy. Whoa! Yeah, that should be it. Nope. The main loot's right there. I don't believe there's any more zombies. So let's just go get what we need to get and get the hell out of here. Another rad remover. I will take it. That's going to go on one of my carbines. Uh, hunting knife. I'll scrap that. I'll sell the hood. My motorcycle's on that side. So let's head down. Open this. Upsy daisy. Okay, let's drop off all this crap in here. I'm gonna take the stuff that I'm gonna sell. So we sh we we do kind of have time for one more, but I do want to. You know what? Let's do this. I'm gonna do the nurse you back to health. I want to see what we're dealing with as far as tier fours go. Um, I would like to knock out another tier three for Hugh, just to try to hopefully guarantee us tier fours 
tomorrow. It is getting kind of late and I'd rather get a few of these done because I wanted to see what kind of rewards I'm going to get for this one. And I'm not messing around with these nurses. We are using the M60. Not even playing. What do we got? What do we got? Okay, radiated. Okay, good, 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 good. No throwing up. Okay, let's all get... Oh! Stay down. Oh, what the crap? Cool. Well, let's go see what kind of rewards we get for it. So then I'm guessing... I'm guessing... Why do I uh, have these weird speech complications sometimes? Look at this puppy. Hey, puppy. No! Oh! Oh, I thought he was going to get out of the way. Silly puppy. So what I was saying is I think maybe tier fives were dealing with tough zombies instead of Can demons. Can I help you? Great job. Okay. This doesn't help me. Liquid nitrogen mod. Hmm. I like it. I'll take that though. And let's grab another job from her. Oh, yeah. Can I trust you? Radiated soldiers. Should be easy. Quickly. Bunch of crap. Steel helmet. And laser sight mod, I think, is probably the more... Yeah. Okay, time to sell some crap to you. Let's go boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. I'm not going to grab a job just in case tomorrow we have tier fours. So I'm going to leave it. I'll come back and I grab one tomorrow. For now, let's just knock out her tier fours and then hopefully get to tier fives with her soon. What is going on right now? Got some loiterers to deal with first. Switch guns. All things are set. All right, let's do it. Where you at, guys? Anyone on this side? No? Oh, there they come. Ah! Oh, so scary. Oh, they're crawling. He's a crawling. Back up. He did. Listen, dude. You ain't even worth my time. Ow. You know, I barely got hit by the zombies and I hit myself into a freaking cactus. Great job. More bows. Uh, coil shell. I will take. And I guess maybe skill notes. Compound bow for selling, which would be good. You know what? I can always get more skill notes. Grab another job, man eater, and then I'll do. Can you help oh, me? We're gonna do radiated dogs eventually. That's crazy. So it's almost nineteen hundred. I think what I'll probably do is I'll end it with this one, and then in the morning we'll come here bright and early and just kind of knock out as many more quests as we can whoa chicken almost got you with my back tire dude you gotta be careful i don't like this tree move it oh there's so many There we go. Man, that's the first time it's actually shocked someone. What the crap? All right, well, that's that. Crickets are chirping. That's my cue to leave. I feel like the sledgehammer or Eric's sledgehammer was shocking people more when I first got it than it is now. Like that was like the first shock that I could think of all day. So it's a little weird. Now, somebody did mention that I could probably put the repulsor mod on there. Now, I'm going to see. I don't think I can craft it. Um, if I can, I'm going to look into that and see if I can craft it. And chances are, as soon as I do craft it, if I can craft it, I'll probably find one because that's just how this game works. But I'm curious if the mod will stack with the actual like weapons innate ability to shock. Can I help you? Ooh, auto shotgun. Hey, that's a good, good reward right there. 
I'll take that. And I'll just take steak and potatoes. Because I don't need that. Even though it's more money. And I'll take the potatoes. Um, and let's grab nothing special. Oh, you? this is gonna suck. Whites, freaking spiders, screamers. But we're not doing that today. We're gonna do that tomorrow. Let's see, what do we got? We got the auto shotgun. That'll help. We'll swap that out and make sure that we got that loaded with as many mods as we can. Um, might throw this on there if I can. But that's going to be it for this episode. Tomorrow, like I said, we'll pick things back up. We'll do some quests. We'll grind out as many as we can. It'll be day 30. And then uh, day 31 again. We'll just start the morning off. Luckily, now we have, ooh, we have a, a watch. So I know what time it is. And I know exactly when to kind of hightail it back to the base. And hopefully that Horde night is good. And I'm hoping sometime after that, um, we can collect enough hazmat fibers hopefully from this horde night we get a lot of hazmat zombies or hazmat tough zombies or whatever it is that drops the hazmat fibers that way we can at least try to craft the hazmat um hazmat stuff now another thing could be is i might have to hold on to my skill points and then ultimately just uh max out where is it nope oh, scientist get master scientist because we need 10 points for that so i don't know if we can get 10 points uh by horde night which i think we should between all the questing that we're going to do in the next couple days plus horde night i think we should be able to get 10 skill points and i'm just going to stockpile that just in case so that if we need to we can just craft the anti rad meds versus the mod and just kind of head out there and kind of wrap things up because Again, I don't know when 1.0 is coming out, but I do want to kind of wrap this up within the next week or two. Um, and then hopefully with 1.0 coming out, um, we can start a new series. Now, what I might do is just kind of keep this going. Even if we do complete Anna's quest, I might just go kind of, you know, just raid some random POIs like the UFO, which I do intend to at least do in one episode. And other things like the launch pad and other, like the, the Persian house, like there's some really cool POIs in here that I want to kind of go into and kind of poke around and see what's in there. And that will probably be in episodes after we've completed everything so that um, we'll have some content until 1.0 comes out. And when 1.0 comes out, like I said, I want to come up with something more traditional, like if I can, where there's no horde nights and I just want to do like wandering hordes and just, you know, kill a bunch of zombies. But that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you guys next time. Goodbye.